Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And uh, so I've got a combination of old products and new products today. And I thought I'd go ahead and show you um, what I've been playing with as far as my new uh, eyeshadow palette. And I started out with the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Hydrating Foundation. So this is the foundation instead of the tint. Um, I'm wearing 30 Fair in that, and uh, so that's what I have on for my base. I also have uh, the Pretty Fresh Concealer on as well, and again, it went ahead for me, so I can't find it right now. Um, as far as my bronzer, I have the uh, Avia Beach. Um, this is one of the ColourPop bronzers. It's one of the lightest and the most neutral of the the bronzers so it's one of the two lightest ones and um, as well as that I went ahead and I've been trying to go ahead and do um, a cream blush and a powder blush just to get them to stay on uh, longer because I've been my blushes always fade they just do that and so this is actually the bare blush uh, by Beauty Pie and I went ahead and mixed this with, um, let's see, this is the Bloom by uh, Beauty Bay and the Bare Blush by Beauty Pie. So I went ahead and put both of these on, mixed these today. And then as far as what I did for a blush topper, I went ahead and used this, and this is from the Apricot Me Not collection, and this is Addicted to You. It's actually a highlighter, um, but I went ahead and used it as a blush topper today. And then as far as my highlight, I used the Seismic, and this one is from ColourPop as well. So that's uh, what I have on as the actual highlighter. I also went ahead and uh, did the Sungasm, Sungasm Powder on here. This one's uh, from Catrice. You can get this on, um, let's see, on Amazon or you can get it on the Catrice website. And it's a really shiny, really fun summery powder. So this is what I used as a finishing powder all over. And it's what's given everything the very glowy, glowy look. And then as far as what I used for my brows, I went ahead and used the NYX Thick It Stick It in the Cool Ash Brown. And I used the ColourPop uh, Gel Eyeliner in Purple. Uh, the new palette I have is the Berries Palette. And this is from Beauty Bay. And so I went ahead and got the 16 Pan Palette. This is actually the mid-sized one. They have a 9-pan uh, Berries palette, a 16, and a 42-pan. And uh, the 42-pan, I think, has a combination of uh, berries and purple. I'm not quite sure. I didn't get that one. Um, but this is what I have. And uh, this one definitely has a coral area and a berries area and a couple of pinks in here as well. And I went ahead and used this one on the inside of the eye. And then I went ahead and used uh, this um, on the inner corner as well. I used this on the lid. And then I went ahead and used uh, this one on the outer lid. And um, they're very shiny, very, very pigmented. Um, I've been playing around with this palette and doing some um, matte looks with it. And you could very easily just use one of these as, you know, a matte shadow and then just put one of the shimmers on top and that would probably be really pretty as well. And so uh, let me show you the way that the eye look turned out. So that's the way that that turned out. Um, as far as, far as uh, mascara, I used uh, Double Trouble by Essence. And this one actually has different bristles on it. So one side is actually a traditional brush, and the other uh, side of it that's pointing it down right now, I don't know if I can get it even to show, um, but it has little tiny short bristles, a lot of them, and they're very 
spiky looking. So you use one side for length and the other side for volume. And so that's what I went ahead and used today for mascara. And uh, that's another one you can get over at Ulta. Uh, the ColourPop, and this is from the Peeps collection. This is their lavender, and these are called Glowing Lip. And they're really pretty. That's what I have on right now. In fact, I'll go ahead and retouch there. So that's the way that the lavender looks. It's really pretty. Um, I think this is actually, it's either really close or the same formula as the Just a Tense. And uh, the Just a Tense actually have a passion fruit smell to them. And that's, I think, the biggest difference. But um, they're a really, really close formula to the Glowing Lips. And um, yeah, Glowing Lip. And so um, both formulas are wonderful, and both formulas are still available on the color, or on the ColourPop website. And then uh, what I used as far as a gloss is the Tower 28 Cashew. And actually, I'll put a little bit more of that on as well. So uh, that's the look. Um, I definitely go ahead and recommend the Beauty Bay. Again, very, very pigmented and a lot of fun just to play with. And um, brand new palette to me. It's been out for a little while, but um, definitely I think worth it to go ahead and um, get a very fun berry look, which I haven't actually had in a while. So uh, that's the video, and I hope that you have a great day, okay? Bye.